Today we have a, uh, an interesting uh, point at the market with the euro dollar down towards the bottom of the range near 105 and two key event risks affecting both the euro and the dollar over the next two days. The U.S. retail sales report today and the ECB meeting tomorrow, either of which could move either currency uh, either way. Uh, so really it's about trying to figure out a way to trade uh, something like a situation like this uh, with uh, reasonable risk and reward. And it's very tough sometimes to do a spot trade over these key event risks. So we're looking at a potential further euro dollar downside. Let's say the U.S. retail sales report bounces back strongly, sets in motion the idea that the U.S. Uh, recovery is on track. Some of the weak data was just about uh, really bad winter weather we had over the last few months. Uh, and then the ECB doesn't really do anything to stop the euro's uh, continued fall. In that case, we look at a two-week uh, euro put spread. Volatility, the reason we do a spread is because volatility is very expensive. So we take a 104.50 strike, for example, uh, buying that one, and then selling a 103 strike. And that way we cheapen the option by approximately a third at current price levels uh, around 105.50. Uh, so cost 40 something pips, uh, possible maximum payout is 150 pips plus, so risk reward something like three to three and a half uh, times on a strategy like this. Of course, we take away the uh, uh, sort of unlimited upside potential by selling that lower put, but it also does cheapen our risk by, uh, by trading it in this fashion.